Welcome back, everybody. So CRT's Meals on Wheels program serves thousands of meals every day to seniors throughout Central Connecticut. And joining me today is Gladys Rivera and Alana Bernstein to explain how you at home can help. Ladies, thanks for being here. Thanks so much for having us. So thanks this is a, a critical program of CRT. So talk a little bit more about it and why there is such a need for it. So uh, the, the uh, Meals on Wheels program serves over 800 uh, homebound seniors. Mm -hmm. um, these are seniors who can't get out of their homes um, for X, Y, Z reasons. They're um, of either on treatment or other reasons, and they can't get out of their homes. They don't have anyone at home during the day to take care of them, so we provide them with nutritious meals every day. Now, Alana, talk about the impact that you're able to make um, sure. just by delivering a meal to a senior who really might need it. Sure. Um, really, you're providing their nutrition. Mm -hmm. um, when someone signs up for the program, a nutritionist meets with them to see what deficiencies that they have. Mm -hmm. And so this meal that they're receiving really helps them not only with their nutrition, but for many cases, it's their social socialization. Mm -hmm. It's the only person that they have contact with if they're homebound. Mm -hmm. And that really keeps people alive. Absolutely. Now, in terms of delivering the meals, are they volunteers who are coming to the organization to drop them off? How does it work? So we have both. We have a fleet of paid drivers mm -hmm. um, that service the great area. And then we have um, city towns that have site coordinators and they coordinate volunteers. So um, they deliver to like Newington, South Windsor, um, Hocken and Maria, um, all the out of out of the uh, way area for us in Hartford. Um, and we really appreciate the volunteers for doing what they do because oftentimes they are seniors themselves mm -hmm. and uh, they enjoy going out and seeing their peers. So now you guys have a golf tournament coming up to yes. raise awareness about this. Can you talk a little bit about that? Sure. Tomorrow is our 18th annual Meals on Wheels Golf Classic. We've been doing this for 18 years. It's a lot of fun. We have more than 100 golfers coming out. Um, it's at Tunxis Country Club. And um, the beauty of it really is, um, obviously the weather is supposed to be really nice, mm -hmm. but we are able to raise so much money for the program. Mm -hmm. We have raised so far over $66,000. Mm -hmm. And that goes directly to helping the program keep going and meet the needs of the seniors. Without this fundraising, we literally could not feed as many seniors as we do. That's incredible. And if people at home want to help in any way, how can they do so? So they can certainly, we'd love to have you join us tomorrow at the golf tournament, mm -hmm. but contact Alana or myself. Um, there are many ways that you can donate money. You can go online mm -hmm. to our website. You can donate sure. that way also, or become a volunteer. We always need additional help. Yeah. Yeah. You're doing incredible work, ladies, and good luck at the tournament tomorrow. Thank We're so excited you. for you. And make sure to check out their website to see a way that you can help seniors in the community. Now